hi guys and happy Friday off always always great I wanted to run around today a little bit and uh, I had a couple of things I wanted to get I went to the Dollar Tree and I bought a whole bunch of this stuff that my dad always asks us to pick up when we're there so um, and I made a basket I made him a basket with all the stuff in it that he's always asking for like uh, they have this oatmeal cream that he likes and all kinds of little things chocolates all, all kinds of stuff I just filled a gift basket and uh, wrapped it up as a little extra gifty you know and uh, went to the thrift and wow did I have a great thrift day let me tell you um, something about the Fridays off and the thrift I just always have a really good time um, but it started out bitter bitter cold and the temperature rose like so much that it felt like spring so that is not a good thing for arthritis and I was hurting today by the time I was done I just had to come home <laughs> just had to get home but then of course I never sit still so I put all the tinsel on the tree because um, I like to put my I love tinsel on the tree I was never able to use it when I had my cats when my cats were alive but um, doggies don't touch it Vaji doesn't anyway but um, I love tinsel on a tree and I put the tinsel on today because you don't put it on too early because every time you pass by the tree the the breeze that you make messes it up you know what I mean so um, I put the tinsel on today it looks beautiful I'll show you pictures in a little bit um, what else all right first of all we're not gonna do the thrift first we're gonna do um, a beautiful package of gifties that I got from Raymond T. Vinyl was on my doorstep yesterday very very excited um, in there was this beautiful hungry pup vintage game it is so awesome little doggy in there with a silver tray and you have to get his bones on the dish this is such a beautiful thing it's so hard to do because the bones are like um, jumping beans like Mexican jumping beans and I can only ever get one bean on the tray but this is such a beautiful thing if I look at that isn't that amazing I loved it so much beautiful little unique thing I uh, sent me a copy of record collector um, of course this is a great British magazine I sometimes um, buy it in um, Barnes & Noble but this issue is the CBGB's issue look at that how fun and of course CBGB's was my old um, stomping grounds so that was really 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 awesome okay now the records oh my god first of all he got me two of the Record Store Day records that I wasn't able to get myself because, of course, I don't have any stores around here that participate in Record Store Day, which really, really sucks for me. And then I have to buy everything I want on eBay. i got to pay more money. But Raymond has a bunch of record stores around him. and all of them participate in record store day and he got me these two things that I had to have and this one is you know the god Frank Zappa doing Peaches and Regalia which is uh, one of the most beautiful songs ever and this is a 10 inch picture disc look at that beautiful beautiful thing oh my god you'll be hearing this in a podcast very soon isn't that gorgeous oh my god and the other record store day thing that I really 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 wanted and he grabbed for me this is on yellow vinyl this is the vitamin string quartet performs the nightmare before Christmas Wow what an awesome thing of course we love Danny Elfman and we love the nightmare uh, nightmare before Christmas soundtrack so this is going to be amazing very excited and then two surprises which oh my god these are so amazing 
for the horror collection. Um, just incredible. This is uh, the Dead Morticians doing Old Dark House 45. Look at that. I don't know how to, let's see, how do we get the, because it's so sunny today. I'm trying very hard. I have a light over here that hopefully will help us. But this is gorgeous, and it is on red vinyl. Beautiful. So excited about this. One side is Old Dark House. The other is Ghost Town and Black Suicide. Isn't that amazing? I am so excited about that. And this! Oh my god. Graveyard Drag Race. Two record 45 set. Uh, four different bands. Uh, one band on each of the each sides of the two 45s. We have the Great Electric Frankenstein. We have the Candy Snatchers. We have the Street Walking Cheetahs. And we have the B-Movie Rats. Oh god, this is so awesome. And these are on beautiful orange vinyl. Look at that. Oh my god, what an awesome, uh, two amazing things for my horror collection. So very excited about these. After I finish um, with you guys, I'm going to play all of these. I can't wait. What a great gift, Raymond. Really, really fun. <laughs> you guys totally spoil me. Between you and Car, man, those gifts were out of this world. All oh, right. In the thrift. In, in the first thrift. Oh, you know what? I wanted to show you this also because uh, it's really fun. Now, in my office, uh, we have an automatic light switch. And I sit and work for hours at a time and don't move. So the light switch thinks the office is empty. So I have to roll my chair out and swing my arms like in front of the light switch before it goes back on. And I said, man, if I'm going to get a Harry Potter wand and use that um, for the lights because it would be so much fun. And I did. I got this beautiful Harry Potter wand. And this one, if you shake it, the light goes on. Can you see that? And if you shake it again, it goes off. So this is perfect. For the light switch <laughs> how fun is that this is really fun i can't wait to use it because i'm telling you the other day the lights went off on me four times <laughs> right in the middle of like crucial number crunching or something you know it's really really crazy it makes me nuts that was really fun all right uh in the thrift in the first thrift i found this crazy thing it's um it's really cool it's the kind of thing that you that you would have seen on your grandfather's bar in the 50s he probably had it from the 40s or 50s see it in the see it still on an, on a bar in the 60s and 70s you know what i mean something sitting behind an old bar forever and it's really a weird thing it's made in Passaic, new jersey which is really cool um probably i'm gonna say I don't know, 50s, 60s, uh, really weird, I don't know. Uh, it, but it says on here, there are more old drunkards than old doctors. <laughs> That's insane. So, it's such a weird thing. It is like the weirdest little glass. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry, lodging for the weary, and good keeping for horses by John Nath. Very, very oddball. I love it. Very strange. I got this beautiful bunny. I love this bunny. This bunny is from the Netherlands. Um, this is an Anne Claire Petit. Amsterdam. Made in Amsterdam. Oh my god. Why is he in the thrift? Did somebody buy him when they went to Amsterdam? Didn't they want to remember their trip? I love him. He's all cotton. He's like cotton, um, like crochet thread. He's just beautiful. I absolutely love this. I couldn't resist the face. 
but I love the colors and the cotton. Just absolutely loved it. And it's from Amsterdam, which is really, really fun. I got a gigantic Santa Giuda. Look at the size of him. This is like the small ones that, that show up a lot, but I've never seen one um, so big like this. He's got to be a foot, uh, foot tall or 13 inches. Really, really, really beautiful. I loved it. Perfect. I got this beautiful rosary. Beautiful red oval bead rosary. Look at that. It is so, I, mean, I think it's better without my hand. It's just gorgeous. Look at the beads. This is a St. Teresa rosary. It's the St. Teresa pray for us. And the beads are just gorgeous. Very beautiful. And I got this beautiful monster gothy ring, which I love very fun and it's really heavy duty it's got a big heavy base look at that it's really really cool weighs a ton um that's what i got in the one thrift and then i went to the other thrift i wasn't going to go to the other thrift and um i said i looked at the i looked at my um phone to see what time it was because the post office didn't open till 10 and I had to get over there and mail something so when I was done with the first thrift it was only 9 30 so that was the deciding factor right there <laughs> so I went to the thrift in Patterson and I found such great things and um, I'm going to show you both of them two great things Oh look, I have my um, Fields, I saw a Fields Santa button on, on my hat that Carm gave me. I love this button. Love it, love it, love it. And Santa is only a few days away. In fact, Santa is right here with us. Can you see him? Kind of dark over there, right? I don't know, but I hope you can see Santa right here. He is one of the things that I got in the Patterson Thrift today. I could not believe this thing. The back, um, his, the back of him says um, his original price was two nineteen ninety nine, and I got him for twenty bucks. Look at him; he's so beautiful. He has a stand on the back, so he can stand freely. He's um, he's um, a little shorter than me. He's just a little shorter than me, so he's like. You know, they call Santa the jolly old elf. So I would say this is life size for Santa. Beautiful. I love it so much. And uh, I was carrying it through the store. And I got to tell you, the people in that particular thrift store are so rude. Oh, my God. They're all like inner city. Um, it's really, it's not a great, it's not a fun place to go like my other thrift and people won't get out of your way they won't hold the door for you none of that that just doesn't even exist there and um, I didn't expect it at all anyway but um, you see somebody struggling with something this big something almost as big as they are and you at least hold the door I would always do that no no I had to push the door on my back and carry Santa <laughs> I hate rude people I, I really hate rude people There's a lot of them in the world, too. There's a lot of very nice people, too. Like, every day, I come in contact with both, so. Um, so I got him, and here he is over here. I want to say what I love so much about Santa is that he has his pipe. The thing that they took away at the mall, at the uh, Big Santa, at the plaza, he's still got his pipe. So that's how you're supposed to see Santa. And it looks like he's giving a high five, right? Love it so much. So beautiful.
Isn't he amazing? I mean, I just love him so much. And I found this beautiful mechanical elf, and he's like, um, it's like a toy maker elf. Absolutely beautiful, and he is very heavy duty. And he had like this snow, like, you know, that styrofoam kind of snow that they throw, snowflake things that they throw throw all over window displays. He had it all in the folds of his clothes. So I was sitting there picking it out when I brought him home, picking all the little pieces of snow out. He must have been like a window display or a store display because he's really, like I said, heavy duty. Just a beautiful thing. So I hooked him into, I have a push button, like a foot thing that you step on to turn the tree on. So the tree's plugged into that and I plugged him into that too and turned him on. So when I step on the foot thing to turn on the tree, he goes also. And I'm going to show you him right here. Isn't he magical? We have to give him a name. Um, he's he's absolutely amazing. I, I, I'm thrilled with him. And just walking into the living room and seeing the tree with the tinsel and the little elf moving, it's just pure magic. All the little toys under the tree. I love it so much this year. Very, very fun. So here's a little bit of the tree with the tinsel. having the worst arthritis pain today I'm uh, so bad that uh, I don't know it's just not going away and it is definitely the, the cold weather turning to warm because that's that really is killer and I have a feeling that there might be some snow or something on the horizon because that that makes it work uh, hurt even even more um, it's just so bad today. <laughs> I couldn't have done, I couldn't have walked anymore if I wanted to. So anyway, guys, we are only five days from Christmas right now. And uh, that time went very, very fast, didn't it? I got some really cool um, Christmas beers for, this, for the, these next uh, couple of days. I got something, um, something by Two Roads. Um, some kind of Christmas ale, something Noel, Noel, Noel beer, something like that. And I got Santa's Private Reserve. And Santa's Private Reserve, I, whenever I see it, I buy it for each Christmas. And Santa's Private Reserve, I'm going to save for um, the reading of the um, Animals Christmas Carol because I'm really, uh, I'm really excited about that. I've been reading it regularly see if I can get through it without tearing up. It's really hard. There's one particular page that makes me cry. It's really <laughs> crazy and it's the page about the donkey. Um, so anyway, I hope I can get over that and, uh, and be able to read it. <laughs> so I think that's it for me guys. I hope you're having a magical, mystical, musical start to your weekend. It is Friday. Um, the weekend is here. It is the last weekend before Christmas, so I know a lot of you are going to be very, very busy. 
I finished wrapping everything today. I think I might run out tomorrow and do one of those little baskets for my mother also. I think that would be fun because I, I really like the way my dad's came out. And uh, I think I, I'm, I'll get her one too. I'll make one for her too. Um, so that's it guys. I hope you're having a magical, mystical, musical Friday. I hope you're all done with your stuff. I hope you're not too pressured. Just take it light. Take it easy. It'll all work out. It always does. Last night I baked the cookies. Um, I really am done. I'm done. Like from here on it's just extra. You know what I mean? So that's really, really fun. And having those days after Christmas off is so great. I'm telling you, I'm going to enjoy it even more because I know I don't have to go right back to work after, which is so cool. So that's it. Enjoy your Friday. I love you all. Comment, subscribe, spread that holiday cheer. <laughs> Tink merch below. I will talk to you very, very soon. I love you. Love you, love you all. Mwah, happy holidays.